This is an emergency video. Hello there, welcome to Armored Warfare. Um, I'm Siobhan McFadden. I've really got to keep remembering who I am. Uh, I've This is the last game I've played, actually. Uh, the reason this is an emergency video is I haven't really got anything lined up. And it's about, oh, shit o'clock in the morning. Uh, I think it's gone half five. Something like that in the morning. I was working and everything went very, very horrible. Um, so this is how I play the M1134 anti-tank guided missile tank destroyer. Your mileage may vary. But I'm waiting to see where the main battle tanks are going. This is Operation Sapphire, by the way. It's on hard. Where are the main battle tanks going? I thought, well, I'll go past with the Challenger. And then thought, no, hang on a moment. This guy's already lit something up. Bang. My idea, and to be honest with you, this is how you should play tank destroyers anyway, certainly in PvE, and PvP to be honest, you stay at the back, you don't have the armour, okay, stay at the back, let everyone else take the hits, <laughs> I'll tell you something funny about that in a moment, um, and just keep shooting, okay, I need to move up. I absolutely adore this vehicle. I've got a thing about missiles. I don't know why, I've just got a thing about missiles. I've got no life, frankly. So I'm going to go and see Civil War on the Saturday. Then I had to do the review video the Saturday night, which took so long to render. Oh dear God. And then yesterday I was at the Brighton... Um, who was it? Who were, we, who were Brighton playing? Oh, they were playing another football team. Derby, there we go. Uh, I, I steward down, down at football matches. And uh, absolutely knackered, so I ended up just crashing. And the next thing you know, I'm suddenly thinking, oh, hell, I don't have a video to put out. <laughs> but this was a good game for me. I enjoyed it. And I thought, well, what the hell? I'm rather pleased with my tactics here. However, I do get caught out. So I'm up here. Everyone else is in front, apart from, obviously, the artillery. Ow! Good old Artie. Come on, Art Ow, Artie. Shoot them. Make me bang for you. Okay, can't get eyes on at the moment. Nothing's lit up for me. Still behind them, you'll notice. Keep an eye on our weasel. All right, he's going up for the top secondary up there. I like nighttime maps. I can put my headlights on. Eee, look, headlights. Seriously, no life. No life at all. Okay, creep forward a bit. I think, should I go for that fragile terminator? No. Let's just see what cups comes up. The weasel's busy taking apart that Ariad. Now I can take the Terminator. I think that hit a pole on the way down, actually. If I don't have a clear shot, I will hit C. I will reload. This thing only fires two missiles at a time, and you need to get both out, if you can, to just get that damage. That can be a lifesaver. So whenever you get a chance, reload. You don't lose missiles. It's the same in any vehicle to be honest with you especially if you're having a clip uh, now here I decide to um, I'm gonna go and help the weasel somehow I'm not sure how eee. Ah, physics don't you just love them slight problem comes up on my right there it is panic 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 nope all right I think this weasel is actually gonna might need a bit of help this guy starts shooting at me this thunderbolt Curse you, Ross. There we go. Get one out. Get two out. Back off. He hits the ground in front of me. Leave it to the weasel. The weasel's got it in hand. That's another thing. You, you do need to trust your teammates. If you get a good team, like the team I had here, then you can do your job knowing that they will do theirs. 
Now, I'm starting to be out of position here. I missed on that. No, hang on, I didn't miss on that one. Sorry, he had countermeasures. I've just remembered. Countermeasures are great when you deploy them, but when you're missile firing, I think... Incoming cat! Hello, Gwen. I'm trying to do a commentary here. Which means I need to see the monitor. There you go. Good go. Okay, taking the odd hit, which is straight back up. Move! Oh, cats. Slave to them. There we go. Again, I'm thinking, I'm at the back, everything's cool and, and... And, oh, God, someone hit the bloody cap circle! Where the hell did all these come from? Run away! Run away! And it really is a case of hello, nurse, here. No! Down to 301. Miracle Max to the rescue! Ow! Okay. Okay, 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 okay. Right. There we go. It's not perfect. But as long as they're looking at everyone else, no, someone else is shooting at me. Didn't touch that Ramka. Rushed it. Can I do better on this one? Oh, that's a bit better, isn't it? Yes, I was seriously out of position there. I had no idea they were going to spawn. This isn't a review of the actual tank, by the way. That'll come later, which reminds me, I've got to do something in a moment. Ah, uh, behind you, you stupid old bat! One. Oh, I only had the one missile left. No. Down to 132 hit points. I've already been to Miracle Max. What's going to happen? It's just uh, Ramka 99. Ah. Oh no, there's more. It's a weasel. I fire at it, but it gets killed before I get to it. Oi, right, will you please stop shooting me? Run away, run away. Did you know that a tactical withdrawal is actually running away with dignity? Right, okay, can I get any shots off? Apparently I can! NPAA caches can I? Come on. Now hurry and go take some batteries. One. That was a good mission, Black Company. Ten kills, nine falls, and a submission. That was a good mission. Now, I should have screened the thing, but I didn't think to. Um, I got, I think it was about 15 to 19,000 damage. I can't remember off the top of my head. Something like that. Uh, ten kills. I also got the award for the tank bouncing the most damage, which would what, be Steel Wall in World of Tanks. I'm thinking, I'm in a bloody tank destroyer. Um, which, if I'm honest with you, shows that I played the game badly. But I only played it badly because I was just out of position. I had no idea at all that spawn was going to happen. And then it was just a case of just run the hell out of there. Um, so hopefully you could pick up from that. Certainly what I do, whether you do it or not, is entirely down to you. But stay behind them. Remember to stay behind your main battle tanks. All right. Keep an eye on the flow of the battlefield. For example, that weasel. I thought, OK, the weasel needed a little bit of a hand, possibly. This thing is quite nippy. I'll nip over there. I'll just, even if just distract something, it gives the weasel a chance. Remember, the weasel, or only thing weasel has going for it is the fast auto cannon and its maneuverability. Um, this thing can at least help. That's what you've got to do. That is what you've got to do. Um, okay, 
there we go that's that um i'm probably talking bollocks let me know in the comments section remember to tell people about this please because i'm still trying to build up my subscriber base and views and everything else like that ever since i stopped giving away free stuff people um <laughs> people don't want to know now now pay attention competition not a real competition the, the, the prize is basically you get your name read out uh, I want to know what tank you want me to review next. If I have it, I'll do it. Um, leave your requests in the comments section, please. Uh, I'll label up, label them out with numbers and chuck them into the random number generator thinking you'll probably... Um, again, I'm not going to tell you what tanks I've got. If I've got it, you get put in the drawer if you don't. There's no prize. I'm afraid. However, remember, part two of the Complete Tanker podcast from completetanker.co.uk does have a competition to win a WZ1224 as well as Chieftain Sixers and Premium Time. Remember that, folks. So pop over there, have a little listen to it. Um, we've also been plugged for the past two weeks, actually, in the Community News on Armored Warfare's website. So there we go. Uh, yeah, Rush Emergency Video, um, where hey, Spelushi Pops. Uh, don't look at the upgrades on this and on the commander on this, that and the other, because I don't think I've actually checked into it. I just wanted to show you my tactics, which were almost spot on. I just got caught out. All right. All right. Oh, good morning, rather. Toodles. Wait, don't go. Hang on. I've just remembered this was the last game I played. I have stats. Hang on a moment. Here we go. Wow. So, there we go. There's that award for um, target. Hit, received the most hits on any player on your team and survived. <laughs> as well as completely successful PV mission with no losses. Um, I got 8,187 rep and gross 2,011... No, 211,606 credits. Details. 158,000 net. 150 and a half. Let's have a look just how much I did bounce. Hmm. Interesting. Okay, so that's not st a steel wall sort of thing. How much damage did I actually take? Total assist damage for 798. 2887. Hmm. Okay. And did I actually get the total amount of total... Ooh, I did get that wrong. I thought it was 15,000. It's not. According to this, 9,339. Shows I can't read. And in the teams. There we go. Um, when it came to damage, yeah, 9,339. And the lowest amount of rep. I don't care, because I helped the team out. There we go. Look at that. Emergency video part two. Toodles. <laughs>